I often say that the older I get, the more I like mustard and mushrooms. It's true, I actually say that. And here's the thing you might not be aware of. Pennsylvania is a mushroom juggernaut, the king of mushrooms. It started when I noticed a road named Mushroom Farm Road and then another mushroom road in the course of my driving around for work. And that got me thinking. The thing is, the United States is the world's second producer of mushrooms and Pennsylvania is the top producing state in the nation. California sits at number two, but those numbers aren't even close. California, number two, they produce about 17% of the nation's mushrooms. Pennsylvania, 63%. That's roughly 3.7 times the amount that California doles out. The world's largest mushroom facility is literally down the street from me, just across the border into Armstrong County is the little town of Worthington, home of Creekside Mushrooms. Operating in an old limestone mine, the facility goes as deep as 300 feet under the earth's soil and is comprised of over 150 miles of tunnels. It is the only underground mushroom operation in the United States as well, which the company cites as a factor in their firmer, tastier mushrooms. Unfortunately, Creekside Mushrooms went belly up at the end of 2010, but there seems to be some efforts being made to reopen the facility under another company's banner, but time will tell if that'll be fruitful or f fungal. Despite Western Pennsylvania's claim to having the largest mushroom facility in the world, it still doesn't compete with Kennett Square over in Chester County. With a population roughly 6,000 strong, Kennett Square produces half, half of the nation's mushrooms. And this has been going on for a better part of 130 years, starting back in the late 19th century. According to Mushroom Farmers of Pennsylvania's organization, it all began with Kennett Square florist named William Swain who decided to utilize the space underneath his greenhouse benches. He went to Europe to secure choice spores and created a successful business that spawned other farms as well as offshoot businesses such as a canning facility. Today there are 60 mushroom farmers in the Kennett Square area and this is the overwhelming majority of the state's mushroom farmers and as such the town of Kennett Square has a mushroom festival each September and I'm told that back in 2010 at least and I don't know if they kept this tradition up instead of dropping a ball on New Year's they dropped a large mushroom. As little as you may have thought about that, mushrooms are a major industry in the Commonwealth. As I said, we are the nation's mushroom juggernaut, despite the overwhelming majority of this occurring only in two counties, Armstrong and Chester. It is an expanding industry worth over $550 million annually, and that's the deal with mushrooms.